Welcome back to my channel. This is Teresa, AKA 50 plus 2013. Hope all is well. This is what's in my refrigerator. And I'm gonna start with what's on top of it. And on top of it, I have some types of glass or clear containers. And this one, it had an air freshener in it. These are some little, I don't know what they are, but I got them from the secondhand store. And they're just little cute glasses. I, I don't wanna say wine glasses. This is a glass that I got from Dollar Tree and I just have pens and pencils in it. This one I have markers and highlighters in it. And back here is the candle that I th candle holder that I thrifted that I don't know what to do with yet. And on the front of the fridge I have my marbled magnetic board and it's really flush up against the stove that's where the refrigerator is positioned so i hate that it's so close because i don't really have the cabinet room i need this is a photo of me my youngest daughter and my two granddaughters my only granddaughters now about this fridge i took the handle off because it just helped the refrigerator look a little neater because it is a used refrigerator that was given to me and it just made it really nice and in case if I want to put some contact paper on it it would just be really nice in the freezer on the door I have this one don't have a connecting handle like this so on the bottom here I just have some tomato paste frozen and a smoothie that I made I have this basket from Dollar Tree not 99 cent store, but Dollar Tree, and I tried to get a pink basket basically to organize the fridge because it's the freezer because it's so small. And then I have frozen bananas, some Walmart blueberries, great value, great value, um, and it's a great value mixed fruit. It's pineapple, strawberry, just some stuff for um, smoothies. And then I have this, and it's the big bag of broccoli florets. So that's just to keep this stuff organized for the most part. Over here, I have one um, vodka, whatever it's called, meat patty left. And that's what this looks like. And then I have a few fish sticks left. So I'm going to put this back in here because I don't really know the instructions for cooking vegan food because I'm not vegan. I'll sit that back there. And then I have my ice tray, which is my silicone ice tray. And I have filled with um, some coconut milk, water, coconut milk or water, I forget. And some ice cubes with strawberries in it. And then a couple with some lemon juice and uh, water. And then I have my ice tray, which is the um, clear pre-made ice cubes. And these are the ones that are just plastic. So I have that. And then two uh, TV dinners that, well, I call them TV dinners, but it's a meal prep dish. And some meals in here that I'm going to have to throw. And then I have, of course, baking soda in here for to keep the fridge fresh. That's all I have in my freezer. On the door, it doesn't have a, this was a fridge that was given to me. It has butter on the door and it doesn't have a closure. So sometimes one or two drop out when I'm um, opening the fridge too fast. And then I have a Ziploc here, why I don't know, and a candy. But on the top is, um, I kind of leave my mask in here and these are uh mask gold mask right there i have some matcha tea three packs because it was getting old i mean i've had it a while and i didn't want it. i wanted to try to keep it fresh so i stuck it in there and then some more face masks so this is where the face mask stays along with this little face mask applicator and then on the next door down i have chia seeds i think you call it 
soy sauce, fish batter, some garlic, garlic, mustard, relish, two jars of relish, some lemon juice, and some more garlic, whole cloves of garlic, and some Parmesan cheese. And then that is just a little drink. It's a, um, a tea my son gave me for my birthday a while back, and I like three years or four years ago, but I just save it. And then on the bottom, I have some Walmart brand Miracle Whip. It's called Whip Dressing. And some Winco, the other store that I shop at, their syrup. It's, I don't like that one, so I leave it in the fridge for whoever. And then in here, I just have tea again that might go bad. So I just put in a refrigerator and hope it prolongs its life. I don't like how I can't really maneuver these shelves. Like it's like they're just not properly spaced out. And no matter how I configure it, it's just awkward and odd. On the top shelf, in the back row, I basically have condiments, and that's all I have. And because I never know how quickly I'm going to get to condiments, I put them in the back, the coldest part of the fridge. So I have barbecue sauce, salad dressing, alfredo sauce, relish dressing for a sandwich, and then three other things of salad dressing. I have this, I have this little container with coffee grinds in it that I'm making a coffee scrub with. I have caught a little thing of coffee sitting inside of a wee yogurt jar and that's for the purpose of keeping the fridge fresh as well. And then I have creamer and a juice. And then the next shelf, I don't have anything except this tray. It's just a shoebox type of plastic tub that I got from the Dollar Tree and I have cheese in it. So this is the one that has cold cuts in it usually and cheese. I have another one, but because not, I don't have any food, I don't keep it in there just because without anything in it. And the last bottom shelf is my purified, purified water and then three other water bottles. Now, these two trays here, I really don't use, so I'm not even sure what's in it. So. I'm opening this up and taking a chance on showing you what's in these drawers. This drawer has uh, all kind of candy that was from whatever holidays that just passed. So you have uh, Christmas candy in here. Uh, let me see how far back it goes. Christmas. And I don't know. Just, it looks like majority Christmas candy, but it used to be maybe... It used to have Valentine's candy in it and and um, Easter candy in it also. And this drawer, oh, I forgot, I have kale, which I should make some kale chips. And this drawer has um, Easter candy in it, Christmas cookies, and my Brussels sprouts. And it has a bag of jelly beans that hasn't been opened, and some some drink tea that I don't like. Those drawers, I never really know what's in them because it's not a drawer that I like to use. All right, so that's a bit of what's in my fridge. Because my refrigerator is semi-bare, it's the weekend and I'm going to be having company. Well, I'm so hot talking about that refrigerator and what's in it. But like I said, it's Friday, I'm just getting home. It is so hot today and I thought I had left the AC on. To my surprise, I didn't. So I'm a sweaty mess right now. My refrigerator is kind of bare, as you saw. I'm going to be having company for a week from coming up Monday to Monday or Sunday to Monday. So I bought a little bit of stuff because I don't know how much we're gonna be eating at home or how much eating out we're gonna do. Today I just brought a few groceries of stuff that will go in the freezer that way it won't like perish it's nothing really perishable so i'm going to show you that stuff right now i got some sliced ham and i only got this because i was told that it's a good meat to freeze and it has an expiration of august so i thought that was good because i'm not really a meat eater and i don't know how long that will last before it goes bad then i got the ultra thin provolone it's 40 calories per slice and there's 20 of them in here 
I usually buy the Walmart brand, but I thought to myself, um, yeah, I don't want the Walmart brand this time. The only thing I'm confused about, it says that it's smoked. And, and I just hope it's not smoked. Yeah, I hope I don't taste the smoke. Or I don't care. I hope I like it as well as I like the um, Walmart brand. I have a dozen of eggs. And I just went ahead and got this loaf of bread. And that's what I'll use to make the sandwiches. And I got it for 60 cents. I picked up two things of coffee because they were on rollback. So instead of whatever they were, they were three something. So I got two boxes and it's French roast. Um, dark. Yeah. Walmart brand. And then I got, I don't know, something in me just made me want to get hazelnut um, syrup because hazelnut was the first coffee that I started drinking before I was a coffee person because I just couldn't drink black coffee if it wasn't flavored. It just, I couldn't do it. And even then I can only drink a half. And then I got this cheesecake and the one in a box that had two so in case company and I we can just have a slice each and I also got it this is called the key lime so I got the it's by Edwards brand and you get two in it but then you get it and it comes like two in that's already pre boxed or whatever got this lean cuisine broccoli cheddar um, rotini TV dinner by smart one which is Weight Watchers and this one is the three cheese ziti marinara I got two because I know I really like that and then I got hot pocket and I got two of those but I ate one already got some Pringles the cheddar cheese ones and then I try I wanted to try and I really wanted Pringles the plain Pringles but I said let me just try the generic brand of stack and just to see because uh these things have gone up they used to be really reasonable now they're like a buck and a half and that's not a lot but i'm just tired of all of the food going up so high so i will place these things back in the fridge freezer and scan it one last time and i hope you enjoyed the video of what's in my fridge and i will see you on my next video. excuse the noise in the background i had to turn that air on because i cannot take it another minute so this is what the freezer looks like now. It has the same stuff over there, the ice trays there, the same stuff down there, and then I just place the um, TV dinners in the back. And so I'm gonna close that. And then down here, I just have the two um, cheesecakes setting up there, and I didn't tell you right there, I just have an apple and a little dish with butter in it. And then I went ahead and filled up the egg tray and put it back in there. And then I put the ham and cheese in there. And that's everything for the fridge. And like I said, because I'll be having company for a week, I don't want to fill up with groceries of things that I like personally when I'm going to be having company. So, there's the fridge. Mm -hmm.